girl TJ back with another Friday video talks with TJ aka TJ Two Shoes Chain Two Shoes Crew. What is going on? Thank you so much for tuning in to this video. As we know, let's just jump right into it because it is a Friday video. So I try to touch on a little snippet from a book that I may have read or am reading at the time. And we are still on the Rich Dad Poor Dad book. And just simply put, like, where is your daily activity taking you? And I'm going to try to get right to the point. I think this aligns 100% with what Gary Vee says a lot of times. People's ambitions are, well, way bigger than their actual work ethic. Like, you have ambitions that are here, and your work ethic is here because you can't consistently do the things you need to do daily to get you to where you need to go. Very simple example. Don't say that you are trying to lose body fat, okay? Because I don't really care about you losing weight. You can recomp your body and be the same weight and have less body fat. But don't say you're trying to lose body fat and you're eating out crap food every single day. You, whatever your daily activity is, that's what's going to lead to whatever result ends up happening. If it's not towards the one you want to have or the one you say that you want, that's on you. You have a lot of creators that will say all of the time, I want this to be my thing. I want to continue to grow. I want to prosper. I want to do X. I want to do Y. I want to be an influencer. Okay, that's great. What are you doing daily? What is your daily activity actually amounting to? What is your daily activity? Like, wh what is it leading you towards? Because you got to have that same ambition that you have for that goal. You actually then have to have that for the work. So that means you actually might have to get up here every single day and produce content you have to be creative you have to be innovative you have to always be on it coming up with things getting in front of a camera and actually producing them and putting them out a lot of people are super ambitious the work ethic may just not be there and you see the shirt like you gotta be savage with yourself be realistic with yourself my daily activity is it actually taking me to where i want to go are you engaging in things that really are not going to lead you down the path that you say that you want to go? And I don't care whether that's with money, whether that's with your fitness, whether that's with your uh, creativity, whatever your focus may be. If you are a creator, whether it's professionally, it can be in a relationship. I don't care what it is. What is your daily activity doing? Because you can say like, hey, I want to be better with money. And we've all been guilty of this where we say that we want to be better with money. And then we do X, Y, and Z that is terrible. <laughs> like leading us nowhere towards our goals. I am not a whole lot different, okay? I've done this before where I'm like, yeah, I want to fall back. I want to save more. I want to do X, I want to do Y. And my daily activity could be like searching for deals hitting submit on the order and buying stuff. That's not helping me towards my goals. We have all been guilty of this, so I'm no different. I've had to be self-aware about where is my daily activity taking me in terms of where I say that I wanna go. So I just want you to do the exact same. Whether you're a creator getting up here, whether you are somebody that is looking to really uh, take hold of your fitness, you have a goal. Your goal can be to lose weight. Your goal could be to gain weight. Like there are people that are trying to bulk and put on muscle. So what are you doing towards your goal? Because if you know you're under eating, well, guess what? That's actually a real thing people do. Like if you know your goal is to bulk, you're gonna have to eat more. If you know your goal is to continue to grow a platform on any social media network, that means that you have to consistently put in the work. There are people that wanna grow their business via Instagram, for example, and they don't engage, they don't post consistently, they aren't engaging on other people's content. That's how this works for you to do it organically. Now, if you just wanna go buy followers and subs, be my guest, but I don't know how to tell you this, especially in the fitness community, it's really obvious when you do that because you have all of these subs and like no comments or no engagement. We are all kind of aware of what you're doing. So I imagine it's going to be no different in any other creative spot, space, niche. I don't care what you call it. You need to make sure that you are actually engaging in daily activity that's going to get you to where you claim you want to be or stop making the claims because you're lying to yourself and that's pretty much unfair to yourself. So that's all for this video. Hopefully you have a great weekend. I am going to uh, try and get a video up Saturday, possibly Sunday. I'm making no promises, but I thank you so much for tuning in to this one. Have an amazing weekend. Peace.